Hey everyone, welcome back. And if this is your first time here, welcome to Trades Tutor. We are the math and science uh, for the trades and simplified. So we're going to simplify all math and science for all the trades. So today we're going to go through a little bit of math, the 45 degree offset. And here we go. First thing we're going to do is show you a little visual on what we're talking about. A okay, piece of pipe goes, it offsets 45 degrees and then offsets once again. So we got to define some parameters of what we're talking about here. So if we were to draw a line, a horizontal line, extending from that bottom pipe, and we were to do the same from the top, we would get a measurement. And that is actually our offset. We define it as our offset. So that red line there okay, is the offset. Now we do a couple more, um, draw a couple more yellow lines here. We'll draw one up there. That's where the offset starts. That's where the offset ends. Now that distance is referred to as the advance. So we have the offset and the advance. And then the piece of pipe that joins the two of the, the, two of the pieces of pipe, that is called your travel. Okay, so now... The idea here, there's a relationship between them. And that relationship can be made by forming a triangle. You can see it's a right degree triangle uh, with a 90 there up in the top left corner. Okay, so there's a definite, a definite um, relationship between the three of them. Now we can remove all this. So these two angles are 45 degrees, hence the name of 45 degree offset. Now what we can do is we can bring this triangle back in there and this angle on the other side would also be 45 degrees and there you go. You have your offset, your advance, and your travel. You can see once again the 90 in the top left corner. Alright, so there's a formula that goes along with this and it's the offset equals the advance. They're the same in this case because if they're both 45 degree angles, well doesn't it make sense that they're both the same? Now the other formula, the, well the first one's pretty not really much of a formula, but this one is. The travel is equal to the offset times 1.414. So the travel is 1.414 times bigger than the offset. Now if the offset and the advance are the same, well it also makes sense that the same formula works for the advance. Well, we're just going to use the one with the offset right now. Okay, And there you go. There's the relationship between them. Now the best way to do this or, or uh, work with this is just actually to have an example. So example number one. Here we go. Find the length of the travel if the offset is 17. So that offset is 17. What's the length of the travel going to be? we go to our formula. Travel is offset times 1.414. 17 times 1.414, the travel is 24.04. In the, in the piping industry, this is one of the main numbers to remember, 1.414, because we deal with 45s a lot, more than any other fitting. So if you can wrap this around your head, the 1.414, you're golden. And that's the key to this whole thing. This is a trigonometry number, by the way, if you're saying, where does this come from? It comes from trigonometry. You can go through the whole trigonometry thing and find the same thing. Or you can go this, uh, this little bit of a shortcut method and just use the 1.414. Now you're saying, well, what, what if it's the reverse? What if we're trying to find the offset given the, tra the, given the travel? Good question. Let's go to that. Okay. Find the length of the offset if the travel is 42. So now we have the travel and we got to work backwards and find our offset. Well it's the same formula just we're going to reverse it a little bit. There's the original formula but now we got to change it to solve for the offset which is equal to the travel divided by 1.414. That makes sense because the offset is going to be smaller. So we plug in our numbers 42 divided by 1.414 and the offset there you go. 29.7. And there you have it, calculating a 45 degree offset. Either finding the offset, finding the travel, and we could even plug the advance in and do that. 
The key thing here is the 1.414. If you can remember that, you've got this. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you have a great day, and uh, hopefully you will check out some of the other videos on Trades Tutor. Maybe even subscribe. That would be awesome. And take care.